Hi, so um, it's Caitlin. You have, not, you have not seen me in a long time. But today I'm going to be making some delicious food. So today I'm going to be making pizza, but on bread. So first, I have my bread and my traditional pizza sauce. Oh yeah, and later today, I'm also going to be making for my family some chicken parmesan sliders. So, first, you're going to want to put on your sauce. Okay, so after you're done with your sauce, uh, set, so oh, we have a spoon holder. <laughs> Would you like to show it? This is our spoon holder. And we also have the full read drumming set. So, yeah, that's about, that's about enough. So instead of just like white cheese, um, we don't have that. So I'm using Kobe Jack, which is also known as Mexican cheese. So you can add as much as you want, which I'm, I'm not going to add that much. I'm going to add a bit more. enough and after that we are going to grab our beautiful spatula grab it put it here and set it in the pan how long do we need to wait until it's toasty okay are you putting bread on top no you're gonna have a one oh wait piece. actually yeah and i'm going to add some extra sauce okay so while that is being toasty, we're going to add some more sauce. <laughs> I don't want it to be on the burner for so long. Okay. Never waste the food you have. <laughs> Please. Okay, I'm going to hurry up and check. Okay, I'm gonna wait for a bit longer. Okay, I would want, like, I wish we had pepperoni, but we do not. Don't you want to put the other bread on top so that way you can flip it? Oh, uh, yeah, I'm just waiting. Okay. I'm very scared to do this. I got this, I got this, I got this. Find a way to put this on. I'm not on like this. Okay, one minute. This is a good way. And so I know there is a way to actually do this properly instead of me just making a pizza sandwich. You're supposed to put it in the oven, but I'm scared to shove my hand in a giant piece of burning toast that could like hurt me. So I did not do that. No, oh, no, I can't really see it. Oh, that's perfect! There it is. Beautiful. The most perfect toast I ever made. I'm very proud of myself. So, okay, we. I already said, but um, the thing I'm making tonight, all I really need is um Hawaiian rolls, uh, chicken nuggets, which are moi, which I'm probably gonna, but they need to be oversized chicken nuggets. Okay, and I also need. Um, this again. Mm hmm I'm gonna make two of these. Um and I also need cheese. Provolone but, cheese. Yeah, but instead of like using shredded, I yeah, I need provolone cheese. Which tastes amazing. Checking. I don't normally cook, but I normally do bake. Oh. A bit longer. Do you think? I need you to check. Oh, that's perfect, actually, now, now that I look at it. Okay, so, then you're going to repeat twice. Which is going to at least, I need to get a bigger plate for this. Because these are not, don't, that don't be like me. We have gigantic plates. Okay, I am back, and um, I needed to do something real quick. 
and um, this is going to be me just making a second one and then showing you what I'm going to be doing. So, I'm going to get some sauce again. Normally, two of these would fill you up. Because we, we, we come from a family that loves camping. Okay, I need my cheese. So, we make these a lot. But normally, we would make these in a pie iron. And I don't, ah, sorry. And I don't like, um... Just making these in pie iron. Pie iron, no. Uh, because then you can't have them all the time. Well, I mean you can, but just not not in pie iron. Okay, so we are gonna pick it up, put it on, and work. There now we go. this one's not gonna take as long because your your pan's pretty warm. Yes, of course. Then all you're gonna do is just. Your second piece of bread. I'm gonna have to make this really quick because I don't want to burn this. And I'm gonna get your second piece of bread again. Thank you, mom. Mm -hmm. And just put. I'm gonna be like dunking this in like sauce because I want to. I'm having so much problems with this stupid spoon. Okay. Okay. Um. Thank you, mom. Then you're gonna want to turn it back on. Is it on? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. Okay. You want this right here? Then always check. Whoa, my! It's okay. okay. It flipped itself. Sometimes you have kitchen mess ups, <laughs> and this is one of them. It jumped out of the pan. And yeah, I jumped out of the pan. Oh no, it's burnt. No, it's not. But it's just toasty. Very toasty. And this one's already cooled off. So perfect. So after this one's done, it'll be really quick. I'm going to start making these on a regular basis now. Why don't you check it? Um, that's good. Okay. It's not. Quiet, no it's not. Never mind. Okay. I did. I'm looking. Okay. So I'm looking on the sides. So the sides get really crispy. But the middle, you need to wait longer to do. So if you don't like <laughs> half, like um, okay, half like cooked sandwiches, or like very easy food. This is your way to go. Okay. So, okay, let me put this back. Um, that was how you make delicious pizza sandwiches. So, thank you for watching me bake this. Come back later today to see me make chicken parmesan sliders for my family. So, bye!